Hello everyone, my name is Ricardo Jimenez, joined by Rachel Baker, and welcome back to another episode of GSB TV. Okay, so I have a question for everyone today because it's been something that, that I've always thought about, especially since all of us here are you know, our consumers and our customers for different uh, companies. Have you ever put a lot of effort into something only for it to go unappreciated? It's very disappointing, right? Well, when you as a business, uh, you know, when you are a business owner, your, your customers are actually gonna, you know, are gonna feel the, the same way. So when a customer chooses a company and are shown that you actually care about them, uh, customers appreciate how well a company can, uh, you know, can make them feel. And in turn, they're gonna wanna continue to, 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 you know, to buy from you and become a loyal customer. So you might be asking yourself, what is, you know, what is customer appreciation? And customer appreciation is, is the measure of effort uh, towards uh, your actual customers. It's a way to show your customers that you actually care about them and are grateful for their business. It's very shocking to know that 68% of, uh, you know, of customers leave a company when they feel unappreciated and, and cared for. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn it over to Rachel who's gonna talk to you about some of the ways that uh, you know, customer appreciation will, will, uh, will help your company and your business. Sure, so there's a number of different ways and benefits from showing your customers appreciation. The first one's going to be customer loyalty. Once you engage with them and show them that you really care, in turn, they're gonna be loyal to you and stick with your business. Um, secondly would be referrals. So again, once you've engaged with that customer, you show them appreciation, they're gonna wanna tell their friends about it. And let's say their friends are doing business with the similar companies who don't offer the same level of appreciation, they're gonna want to leave and come on board with you. Mm -hmm. um, and lastly, in turn from all of that, you're going to have increased profits. Once your customers stay on with you and they bring your friends, you're gonna see your profits grow. So you might be asking yourself, you know, what are some of the ways that you as a business owner can show your appreciation mm -hmm. to your customers? And there's three ways to go about it. And these are very personal, you know, specifically, you know, to me, I, this is how I feel like I should treat my customers. Um, the very first one is to write a, a thank you letter, you know, send them a letter in the mail, no matter if they're, you know, if they've been with you for a month to 10 years, just send mm -hmm. something, send something in the mail saying, hey, thank you for being a customer, um, you know, for such a long time, we appreciate your business. As, you know, as a return, here is a, a coupon to get some sort of incentive, some sort of reward. Um, yeah, and, and even like for the holidays, it's mm -hmm. always a good idea, I would say, you know, um, to send out a happy holidays card uh, showing your appreciation. And then you can also do like a happy birthday card as well. So keeping track of your customers' birthdays and making sure that you go the extra mile, whether it's a card or just an email, something that you can automate, mm -hmm. um, you know, will really show your customer that you appreciate them. Definitely. The second one is gonna, it's gonna, it's a little bit more personal. I, I feel like um, you should give a book out to you know to your to your customers it's a little bit more personalized mm -hmm. whether it was an influence to you personally as a business owner whether it was an influence to your company um, you know we actually do that here we we send out some books to our customers from time to time and just you know Fran here he you know he personally signs the books and sends them out to customers saying hey thank you for being a customer uh, for for this long or thank you for being a member uh, whatever the you know the case may be just send out something that's personal so that the customer feels like they're you know they're appreciated and they're being cared for and the third one is going to be to start a loyalty program uh, rewards program perks anything like that that's going to show the customer that you actually care it's going to it's going to go a long way Absolutely. Um, so just to summarize, guys, customer appreciation is, is huge to your success as a company, retaining your customers and bringing on new ones. Um, so go that extra mile, take that time, really dedicate and personalize your communication with your customers. Uh, we want to thank you for joining us today, and we will see you next week.